Before you create an updated set of construction documents, you should verify the effects of the changes you made in the floor plan to the 3D model. You may need to make some additional updates to some of the elements in your model. As you can see in my model, I need to extend the roof. Back on the annotated floor plan, I add and modify any dimensions or annotation that need to be updated. Next, I want to give the client some wall assembly options. To do so, I insert two drafting views from the provided files into my project. These predefined drafting views contain the wall assembly details for two different wall types. Giving the client these types of options may reduce material costs without having to alter the floor plan modifications. Being able to create construction documents from your building model is an important part of the design process. Revit Architecture has many tools that allow you to easily create the construction documents needed.